Only of his first wife scatter palace in anger over Queen Elizabeth and Temitakwe's car gift. They said the king gifted Temitakwe and uh, Olori Elizabeth uh, a Range Rover Jeep and a Land Cruiser Jeep, respectively, to appreciate them for being supportive and understanding or be understandable hmm. my people oh, anyways welcome back to my channel i greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video we are still on the gist from the palace of oni of ife please if you have not subscribed to my channel go ahead and subscribe if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much my god will bless you and support all that you do so right now they said the wives of the king only of Ife, they are in a serious agony as they scatter everywhere with anger. Moving up and down, from left to right, making noise, lamenting over the king's marginalization. That the king is showing them that, uh, look, oh, this group of people are better than them and all of that. And a lot of people are saying, oh, you think you can disobey the king forever? Or you think... He is going to keep quiet forever. A lot of people have been expecting the king to send these women out. Send them to where they belong. This and that. Da, da, da. And the king have been so quiet to them. Pleading with them. Encouraging them. Promising them that look. Oh, it's not as if you are leaving my palace. That even if you live. Even if you live in your separate houses. I will still be taking care of you. Everything that is required of me to do as your husband. I am going to be doing all of them. All I ask is. Peace of mind, all I ask is for you to live separately so that all these bad bulls that has been going on every now and then will stop. But these people thought that the king cannot uh, do anything when they go against his decision. There are many ways to kill a rat, you know. A lot of people have been expecting the king to, you know, get some policemen and throw these wives out of the palace. There are many ways to kill a rat, like I told you. There are ways that when a man treats a woman, the, person, the woman will ask herself questions. The woman will take correction on her own without even the man speaking loudly or even talking to her. And I believe this is exactly what the king is doing right now. Because a lot of people know so well that uh, so well that Dr. Elizabeth has been so supportive to the king. Dr. Elizabeth is that one woman that will tell the king, "Look, oh my husband, I have understood that uh, Quenomi is your source of happiness, coupled with the fact that she is with your only son, Prince Tadenikawo, and uh, without them in your life, you are not happy." You see what I will do? I will make sure that. Anyhow that I will have to support you to bring them back to your life, I am going to do that. And ever since then, Dr. Elizabeth has been doing just that. Yes. She has been trying to convince Queen Naomi. She has been supporting her husband, the king, to go get Queen Naomi back and Prince Tade Nikawo in his life. You know? And the king, too, knows so well that Dr. Elizabeth has been supportive. Even when the king will go against, Queen, uh, against Dr. Elizabeth sometime, because as a woman, there are things that when your husband is doing, like when she, he, he will keep praising Queen Naomi every now and then, making it look as if Dr. Elizabeth too is not a human being or, and all of that, still Dr. Elizabeth will understand. And sometimes, even, even though she will frown sometimes, say certain things that she's not supposed to say and all of that, but yet he, she will still be supportive to her husband to bring back Queen Naomi and all of that. And this Temi Tokwe, from what I can see of what we have been hearing, in as much as a lot of people are blasting Temi Tokwe that she left her children and all of that, the main reason Temi Tokwe is in that palace is to make name for herself, marry the husband. She is not in a competition with anyone. She is not even fighting the fact that the king wants to go after Quenomi. Her own is, if Quenomi returns, good. If she does not return, good. She's not that type, uh, someone like Erunke and Mariam, who would say, that on, over their dead body will Queen Naomi return back to the palace. They said the Mitokwe doesn't fight against Queen Naomi in any way, allegedly. Because I will always remind you that they are all alleged information. I do not live in the palace, so always bear that in mind, okay? So right now that uh, the king is happy with these two women, 
Recall that uh, the king have restricted the wives that for 30 days he's not going to have anything to do with them, not with the Mitokwe and the uh, Dr. Elizabeth. They are the two people that will always go to him, speak with him, talk with him, enter inside with him, and all of that. As for this, uh, uh, Toby, no one can tell Toby's word about this time around from what we are hearing allegedly. That is why a lot of people believe so whether well she's pregnant. But if she's pregnant, we don't know. If she is not, we don't know. But from what we are hearing, they said them, uh, Toby is scarce right now in the palace. So the only two people that have, that is taking, using, utilizing the opportunity is Demitogwe and Dr. Elizabeth because they are always, they are always with the king. When Mariam, they wanted to go, they will be embarrassed. <laughs> and right now, they said the king have thought it will be a wise thing for him to appreciate these women, the Mitokwe and the... Uh, Dr. Elizabeth, so that they are going to encourage him more, they are going to do more. If you watch very closely, find out that recently that wherever the king is going, he is always going with the Mitokwe. If he's going outside the country, he's going with the Mitokwe. If he's going for any event, especially where there will be uh, educate an event that will be educative, you know, brilliant people will attend. The king will go with the Mitokwe because they said the Mitokwe is such a smart and brilliant woman. And whenever she goes out with the king, she represents the king very well. And that is why she is always going on occasion with the king. It's not to say that uh, Dr. Elizabeth cannot represent well, but from what we are hearing, they said the, uh, Dr. Elizabeth has phobia for flights. You know, she don't like flying. That is why she will always uh, remain in a place for some time because she's af afraid of uh, flying to uh, flying on air. And we do know that some of these occasions that the Mitokwe and the king attends together, they go on flight. So that is why it looks as if uh, Dr. Elizabeth is not going with the king. It's not that she doesn't like going, but she's, they say she has phobia for flights. So, right now, they said the king bought this uh, Land Cruiser Jeep for Temitokwe and the Range Rover for Dr. Elizabeth, you know, just to appreciate them. And they said the wives are crying. They are really shedding tears. They are really crying. The king is just telling them that, look, I have many ways to kill you. I have many ways to send you out of my life and not out of this palace without talking. So that your elders will not come and say, hey, you did this, you did that. You push away, you do this. So guys, when I saw this, I said this is a great move and I love it. I don't know about you. What do you think? Whatever you think, please share with us on the comment section, okay? And don't forget that they are all alleged information. Always bear that in mind, okay? Thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and share it. And subscribe to my channel if you are yet to subscribe. Bye for now. I love you guys.